The American electoral map has changed quite a bit since the 60s, but there's one thing that stayed the same. Utah is a deep red GOP loving state. As a matter of fact, every single Republican since 1968 has won the state. But it looks like Donald Trump could be putting that streak in jeopardy this year. Utah Republicans may be revolting against Donald Trump as their party's choice for president because... Take a look at this with me. New poll showing there is a, a virtual tie. Anything but a huge Trump win in Utah would be a big deal. The last time a GOP nominee won with less than 20 points was during the 1992 election. And it all can be boiled down to Trump's relationship with Mormons in Utah. Trump just rubs most Mormons the wrong way, despite his apparent love for them. And do I love the Mormons, okay? Do I love the Mormons? A recent poll found 73% of Mormon voters say Trump doesn't share their values. That bleeds into his overall statewide unfavorability, which sits at 71%. And these numbers came out before the leaked video showing Trump bragging about sexual assault. Since then, it's gotten worse. Utah's lawmakers began to jump ship or call on Trump to leave the race. Mr. Trump, that I respectfully ask you, with all due respect, to step aside, step down, and a paper owned by the Mormon church did the same, even calling Trump's words evil. And then there's this guy, Evan McMullen, an independent presidential candidate and a Mormon who is peeling off serious support from Trump in Utah. He's only trailing Trump by six points among Mormons, and that's with essentially no name recognition. It's hard to tell if flipping Utah is actually possible for Hillary Clinton or McMullen. There hasn't been a poll showing Trump actually losing, he's just dangerously within the margin of error. But even the fact that one of the reddest states in our union is even in play proves once again that 2016 has flipped everything we thought we knew on its head. For Newsy, I'm Eugene Daniels.